snack you can see them in the calendar snack which I've been talking about in this particular series uh, and that was a clavio button so if I make this a little bigger you saw the fact that I went out and I created a calendar snack I grabbed the grab and go button for the RSVP button itself and I put that code into here which is the click interface into a URL for Clavio. You can see the Clavio uh, email campaign engine there and it's a simple copy and paste. This is our no code engine that generates these calendar invitations if you will to be inserted into email platforms like Clavio. Um, we do this for numerous other uh, email calendaring platforms but in addition to every time you're using our button technology there's something else that is adjacent to it uh, in the calendar snack and that's called our landing pages so if I click this one here you'll see it generates a uh, landing page which is a URL you could use as one example um, but the coolest piece of tech we've built called the upcoming landing page and that is essentially anytime you drop a calendar snack to our service we build you a no-code automated uh, landing page that is for all upcoming events chronologically. So that being said, I was using the button technology with regards to this event here, which when I sent it out a Clavio deployment, the end user would click this and go to this landing page and he or she would be sent a calendar invitation. In addition to that, you can deploy this, which is coming out of this stack here, this click button here, I'll do it again, and that is all the chronological events coming up for you in your persona sent to our service uh, are in this automated page. So to show you that this automated page does work as advertised, I'm gonna send a calendar invitation for this promotion on July 26, 23 to Chris I'm going to click the get the invite button and Chris has been sent a counter invitation. So here's Chris here. You can see that here, Chris at techvader.com. I'm going to refresh. It takes just a second in a live demo for this thing to traverse the internet and come to Chris. Um, hopefully you'll see it here in a sec. Now, if Chris already got one, that could be my bad. And uh, the demo... Um, is not so good but give me a second here i don't believe i sent one to chris uh no i did not so we don't duplicate the sends but here in the live demo you can see that chris was sent the calendar invitation uh, that calendar invitation came off this landing page here uh, chris at techvetter.com i sent it to you. you can see it showed up in chris's email chris is going to say yes in the persona and move this window out of the way i'm going to put this window out of the way and you will see that in the panel itself, in the admin panel, which is back to the, the report for the dashboard for this particular invite for Wednesday, July 26, 23, I'm going to refresh it. And you'll see that not only the Clavio invitations that were sent um, are tracked, but this one off the upcoming landing page has been sent. So let's go to detail reporting. And you'll see that right here. Three have been sent with Clavio. The three people they were sent to said yes. And Chris, off the landing page, uh, said yes. And the one in which was sent to the TD Cynics, uh, I will go to right now, which is on my mobile device, which you won't see, but just bear with me one second. And I'm gonna RSVP to it. I'm gonna say yes. Uh, off my mobile phone, and if you just give it a sec here, which is kind of stretching the the uh, the uh, demo time here, and I apologize for that. It's more or less a, a kind of a big no-no in live demos, but um, I'm only up on a couple minutes here. You see that uh, Greg at at, um, at TD Cynics is still uh, unaccounted for. I've sent the yes to the service across the internet. And I'm just waiting for that to show up. And there you go, right there I said yes. Um, if in fact somebody says no or maybe, this does change automatically. Um, and that's the end of the demo. I'm gonna shut up now, thanks.